concerns and questions over plans to change where hundreds of CMS students go to school. Earlier today, parents packed into the gym at Dilworth Elementary School where school leaders addressed that issue. NBC Charlotte's Alex Shabbat is live outside the CMS administrative building. And Alex, what kind of information are administrators sharing? Well, Brooke, school leaders are passing out maps like this with the new boundaries showing right there. But some parents say it's a lot to take in in a very short amount of time, and now they're calling for a delay. That's asking a lot of this community. Mom's debating the new map. Well, I just want to delay this vote. Next to dad's calling for a pause to the plans. This was 18 months of research that was given to us um, about 10 days ago. So we just need time. It comes just weeks before the school board votes on proposed changes to where hundreds of CMS students go to school. That includes here at Dilworth Elementary, where they would be moving to Sedgefield School. I feel pretty positive, but it's just a little fast. Our neighborhood is being asked to carry the burden um, of other neighborhoods. In this public hearing, Superintendent Ann Clark addressed the issue of delaying a vote, saying it would also delay getting needed resources to Sedgefield schools. Because we would lose a summer, potentially, um, where we could be providing that targeted professional development. For some, the geography itself causes the biggest concern. I never in a million years thought that as a walker, I lived two blocks away, never thought in a million years that this would be taken away. We just want to go back to having a neighborhood school. We just want to be able to look out our door and see our kids play and know what school they're going to. A CMS spokesman says the district is looking at scheduling another public hearing in the evening for Dilworth schools, but nothing has been officially decided. And right now the school board is scheduled to vote on that reassignment plan on May 24th. Live in Charlotte, Alex Shabad, NBC Charlotte. Alex, thank you so much. New here